trundling northwards across the country at the moment. The reason, the low pressure, but more exactly, in fact, this weather front, this is where we've got all the heavy rain from parts of Northern Ireland down through across the north of England and out towards the more southeastern parts of the country. And it's just on the forward edge of this that we've got the thunderstorms crackling around still at the moment, way up through the far northwest, up around Cumbria, down through in across the northeastern areas of England. And they've got southern Scotland in their sights. This is the way that the thunderstorms and showers are moving, dragging on some bits and pieces of rain further south too. The main thrust of the thunderstorms and rain then moving gradually northwards through the evening and the night, getting right up into Scotland but not quite into Shetland by morning. Uh, behind we'll see the skies beginning to clear a little. It'll turn rather misty, turning out drier by the end of the night, but some of these western coastal districts will still have at least a few showers around. For most, the wind's coming into the south or southwest and not too strong, but still a fresh or even strong southeasterly in the far northeast of Scotland. Now this is where that weather front will still be hanging around, even around the middle part of Thursday, so it's where most of the cloud and the thicker cloud giving the rain will be. But even here we'll see that clearing away into the afternoon. Elsewhere, well, a little bit misty in places to start off with, but a fair amount of morning sunshine coming through. Of course, these western coastal hills will already have a few showers, and rather more showers building up as we move into the afternoon. Again, more chance of thunder, more likely the heavy frequent showers across Northern Ireland, southwest Scotland, and down through northwest England and Wales, with some of the more southeastern districts perhaps missing those showers just about altogether. Now, although it'll still be relatively warm, not so compared to today across some of these eastern areas of the country, it was really very warm. Temperatures tomorrow will be four or five degrees lower. Looking further ahead, a little bit of a ridge of high pressure on Friday, some bright weather, a scattering of showers in the north and west, but they'll give way in the afternoon as rain slides up from the southwest Wales and into Northern Ireland. A few doubts about exactly what happens at the weekend, but it does look as if we'll see one weather system after another sweeping in our way. So belts of cloud bringing rain in the north, showery bursts of rain further south, heading west to east, not only on Saturday, but on Sunday too. It'll probably warm up a bit again. Bye-bye.